Hi guys, Dan Stollers here. Today then is episode 81 of the £50 in 50p coin hunt book 2. The aim of the game is to collect every different back commemorative in UK circulation. With two more commemoratives being released this year, there's currently 64 different back commemoratives out there. Like I say, this is the second book. We still do need that Olympic wrestling for the first book. I really can't wait to get that one. That's our first book complete together and then we can fully focus on this second one. This second book, however, is really starting to fill up fast now. We still do need some super rare ones, the rarest of them all, to 2009 Kew Gardens. Along with the rarest from the Olympics set, the offside rule explained, and also the rarest from the Beatrix Potter set, the Flopsy Bunny 50p. But if we stick at it, hopefully we can try and find some more before Christmas. So we're off to a flyer then today, the 2018 Taylor of Gloucester, followed by another Beatrix Potter, the first Peter Rabbit 50p, a three to be released into circulation. The 2016 Peter Rabbit full face half whisker there on the left. A lot of people looking for that one at the moment. With 9.6 million of those being made back in 2016, you would think there's a lot of them out there. That definitely isn't the case and it is one of the hardest Beatrix Potters to get hold of simply because it's the Peter Rabbit and it is the first Peter Rabbit to be released. And for the fact it's an absolute stunner as well. The next coin then, the Team GB Rio Swimmers 50p. This one not part of the Olympic 50p coins. This one actually released five years after the 29 Olympics were released. But you will need that one for your collection if you want to complete them all. It is only worth its face value of 50 pence. But again, another really nice design. Always do check the backs of those shield coins. The years you really do want, 2009, 2010, 2011, 2016 and 2018. I will jot them down and put them at the side of every coin hunt just so you guys can try and remember them a little bit at home. Those were the years that the Shield 50Ps weren't meant for circulation. They were just released in presentation packs. However, sometimes they do turn up in the change. People will open them up and spend them not knowing how much they're worth. And for example, the 2016 Shield, that does sell for £75 every time. So they definitely are worth looking out for. The next one then, the Benjamin Bunny. From next week, I'm going to be signing all of the Benjamin Bunnies I find in the coin hunts, putting them back out there into circulation. And let's see if anyone can find any Dan's Dollars Benjamin Bunnies signed for at home. The next one then, the Paddington 2019 outside St. Paul's Cathedral. And with all 2019 coins, do keep hold of them until the mintage figures have been released. A vintage figure is exactly how many of the coin was made. We need that number to work out the true value of them coins. I do believe it's probably five to six million, so it will only be worth maybe one pound for a perfect and circulated. But you are doubling your money, and we can only hope that them vintage figures are as low as possible. So five in total today, a really nice collection. But for me, the star find, not the rarest of them all, but definitely the best design in my eyes. Hope you enjoyed the video, guys, and as always... Thanks for watching.